tears. Oh, baby. Baby. <laughs> Hi, guys. So, today I had a day, okay? And a lot of you guys are commenting. I haven't posted today because um, I had a field day. That's how it felt. Like, I was just outside just playing sports. Like, that's how my mind is, like, everywhere, okay? Long story short, your girl went to the club last night. Uh, while I'm at the club, I call Bonita or whatever. We have this spiritual number. You guys know I've been on a spiritual journey. I tag her, and I'm like, Bonita, what I did not know, because I'm not paying attention. I'm drunk. I'm wearing my little Chanel sunglasses. I'm lit. In the side top box. Apple has started putting pictures up there from your camera roll. And there was a picture of me and DeVito. And this is my friend that I've known for four plus years. Okay. Um, I end up going home, going to sleep. I'm out. Okay. Knocked out. Your girl's tired. I wake up to Bonita and my other friend blowing my phone up. They're like, Courtney, why are all these African people tagging me talking crazy to me i'm like what so i go look and i see that the picture has been been posted on a couple of blogs right i tell them y'all i'm going back to sleep i'll handle it later because i deal with being posted on the internet i've dealt with it before you ignore it it don't go nowhere it gets posted it's gone in 24 hours nobody cares okay so i'm telling them just leave it alone now, my friend Bonita and my other friend, they aren't, they've never been in a social media scandal or issue, right? And like I told y'all, Bonita is not to be played with. So she has all these random people on her page, cussing her out, calling her out of her name, just going crazy. So I told her, I said, if you want to DM with people and argue all day, go ahead, but do not post nothing, okay? This man has a fan base the size of the world. He's worldwide, okay? I'm like, do not post nothing on your page. This is what I said, okay? I lay back down. I go back to sleep. I wake up to my phone ringing again, and it's them. They're like, these people are harassing me, da da da, da. I said, look, when I wake up, I will make a statement. I will let them know. My homegirl, I just tagged her in it because the number's you know, I was calling her what the time was, whatever. Okay, I was out, I was drunk. But my homegirl is not me, has nothing to do with me. That is me in the picture, right? I was going to clarify that. But, of course, because Bonita don't play, she's online defending herself, going back and forth with everybody, okay? And she's like, they want to troll? I'm a troll too. So, mind you, there is a video, okay, that I had sent to my group message, right? It's a group message of three of us, okay? And these are people I've known for a very long time. And it's not funny now, but we did laugh about it at one point because the video is dramatic, okay? I'm not gonna speak on the video. I'm not gonna speak of the context of the video. I'm not gonna speak of what the video even was about, okay? But Bonita, I told her, you can DM people all you want to. Do not post nothing. Okay, I did not give no permission for nothing to be posted at this point. I haven't even re I haven't replied. I haven't reacted. I haven't said nothing. My lips are closed. Your girl is asleep because I know if I just put my phone on charge and go to sleep when I wake up, I might have a bunch of comments, but it would have died down. You know, that's how it usually works. So Bonita ends up posting this video. It's on there 30 seconds because as soon as I get the notification, I call her. I'm like, why would why would you post that? Take it down right now, immediately. I, I didn't say you could do that. I don't support that. Why would you do that? She's like, well, they're trolling, so I'm trolling. And I tell her, I said, well, Bonita, you might think you're trolling, but what it looks like is that you're inserting yourself more into a situation. Because I told her, all you really had to do was say, that's not me in the picture. My homegirl just tagged me because we have a number situation and a phone call type when we're drunk situation, okay? But, of course, Bonita trolling, going back and forth. She posts the video, right? Bonita has never met this man, seen this man, been around this man in any context, okay? At all, right? And I had told her, I said, the picture was one thing. You posting that video opens up a whole nother door that I'm not ready for. Nobody's ready for. I don't want to deal with it. I don't want to talk about it at all so therefore why would you do that 
and I told you, do not post nothing, okay? Granted, when someone's being attacked on social media and they're not used to it, they'll feel the need to defend themselves. I can give her that. But that video was something personal. It was something emotional that shouldn't have been posted at all. I don't support it. I don't approve of it. And I never gave permission for it to be posted. Okay? So now at this point, another friend had commented, and I want to apologize on behalf of that. She called all the Africans roaches. And I don't approve of that message either. As you can see, I did not comment or say anything probably until an hour or two ago. Okay? Until the end of the day. Because I had nothing to say. I'm, I made a mistake. I posted something I didn't intentionally mean to post. And I just wanted it to go away. So at this point, everyone's messaging me. They're talking crazy to me. Comment, call me, B, H's, all types of stuff, okay? I did not know that this man was married. Anytime that I was ever around DeVito, it was for one or two things, okay? And it's because I'm either styling him for an event because that's what I do. I also help guys, I style people, okay? Whether it's athletes, whether it's rappers, anyway, I, I'll go to the mall and I'll put you something together, okay? I will. I do that. Or another thing is I would help him with bookings. So whenever he would come into Atlanta, I know all the club owners. I would call around, hey, the Beatles going to be in town. Do y'all want to book him for a night? And, you know, that's another way that I was able to make money. I would book him somewhere. I would make, of course, a percentage for booking him. And that's it, right? So at this point, I have never seen a wife um, I had only ever seen a baby mama, to be honest, ever. And I knew he had multiple baby mamas, but I didn't care because it wasn't my business to ask. I never thought to ask, hey, are you married? Because it, it never crossed my mind. So now I'm being attacked on social media and it's like I'm just being perceived in a way that I don't like because I am not a person who's going to destroy somebody's energy. I'm not going to post something that's embarrassing that I know will hurt somebody's feelings. And I just don't like that because this is a friendship that I've built the last four or five years. Okay, we're locked in. We don't really, he don't care about me posting. He don't care about me taking pictures because we have nothing to hide. Okay. And of course the media is going to screw stuff up how they want to, but I have been dealing with this all day. All mother day. Okay. So right now what I want to say is that I didn't post the video. I didn't give permission for that video to be posted. I do not want to speak on the contents of the video or where it came from or what it was about because I just don't want to, and I don't have to period, point blank. Um, I understand my friend Bonita feeling like people were attacking her. So she started trolling, okay? Because she didn't know how to handle the situation. I've had media training before. I know how to go about stuff like that, okay? She does not. You, somebody tag Bonita and something, it's, it's y'all gonna go back and forth all day. All day. She don't care, okay? So I'm not mad that she posted the video. I am upset that I specifically said, do not post anything. If you wanna argue with people in your messages, do it all day. But when that video got posted, it opened up a whole nother door that I myself was not prepared for. And I just don't wanna deal with at all. And like I said, I wanna say sorry to all the Africans for the roaches comment from a fellow friend who was just on there trolling back. Because you guys were sitting there messaging them, harassing them, expecting them to say nothing. If you got thousands of people on your page talking crazy to you, you just going to sit there and say nothing? Everyone's not like me. Everyone's not just going to let it go. Okay? So I got on here to give you a little summary of what happened today. Um, there might be a part two. Um, me and DeVito are still friends. He understands that I made a mistake. I was drunk. Um... He understands that even with the video, I didn't have control over that. And I made it very clear that I did not want nothing posted. But they had made their own adult decision to do that while I was asleep. Okay? I woke up to this, y'all. So, I just kind of wanted to give a rundown and let you guys know. But, yeah. Like, y'all have to stop harassing me. Okay? Um, 
I can admit when I'm wrong. And that's pretty much it.